What's happening, family? So this is episode four of the Black-owned companies that we're going to celebrate during Black History Month, and this company is uh, for the most part near and dear to me because I got to see a fair amount of what it took for them to get to the point they are now. And we're talking about none other than Bevel, our Walker brand company. So Tristan Walker, a black man, noticed that in the market there was not a product lineup for black men with our beard types, the coarse hair, the flat ribbon hair, as uh, uh, explained by uh, Professor James Small, that our hair is uh, more flat than it is rounded, like other groups. And typically, the razors we use were triple blade, double blade set up. And what it does, it pulls the hair um, up, then it cuts it, which of course leaves the hair right below the skin line. So your skin feels smooth. The only problem is, now that your hair follicles below the skin line, your skin naturally closes up, which causes hair bumps. So what he did is he went back to a more simpler times with the single blade uh, safety razor. You get your brush so you can uh, create your lather, prime rolls, storing bombs, and everything like that in a singular kit. And I remember buying that kit, you know, being one of the first wave of customers to come through, or, you know, just back when they had the large, bulky packing, packaging. You know, of course, I was excited, you know, I'll throw a card to that video up there. And I was just like, yo, this is dope, man. It's good to see a product like this on a national level, especially with backing, you know, from uh, big names, you know, Charmaine God, DJ Envy, and then one of the biggest names, Nas. If you ever heard Nas use the, the, the bar signature fade with the bevel blade, that's because of his involvement with bevel. And uh, I remember, you know, having the kit and using it to shave my head, you know, because I really wasn't going to shave my beard like that. But using it, it was like, you know, just being super excited and then seeing him go from that to actually having their own trimmer uh, from a black owned company, you know, and it's rechargeable, replaceable battery. You know, little details like that, you know, for the barbers, has a little uh, built-in hook. Watch me not put it back in there. Okay, oh, we got it, we got it. Um, you can also use a cord as well. It has an LED indicator uh, strip right here to let you know when the battery's low, let you know when the battery's charged. And I was like, man, that's super dope. Going from the first set of trimmer heads they had on there to having a, v a V2, I have a video about that, and then also having the T-Blade which I was excited about getting that. And um, they also have an all black trim, which I do want to get that. We'll probably get that later on down the line, but they kept going, they kept moving. And the next product they came out with was their beard balm. And I have a video on that. This is the only thing they came out with at the time. They just had the balm at the time. It did very well, uh, they're still very affordable. And then boom, you know, that. unfortunately they had to get picked up by a parent company just so they can compete with other companies that were rising, like, you know, the Harry's, Dollar Shave Club and everything like that to compete on a national level and stay in the eyes of consumers. Now they have aluminum free deodorant. You know, they have, uh, you, know, the beard, the, you know, their beard oil came. They got the face wash, the serum, the exfoliating toner, exfoliating gel, body wash, lotion. And I was like, yo, that's crazy. And they're still going strong to this day. They even have a, uh, a product line for the women with their hair. And it was just great to see a uh, black man's tenacity and how he just came through and did what he had to do. He uh, sold himself his brand and, and what he believed in. He's in Target, he's in Walmart. You can go online and uh, ship directly to your home and order parts and have mailed at certain stores. You can even get a subscription service at getbelt.com. So I'll throw a link in the description. Let's show them some love. Pick you up some products. Ladies, get something for your man. And let's support this company and show them love for Black History 2021. Peace and blessings.